What's up guys, today I'm going to tell you um, a little bit of information about uh, Henry VIII. Okay, now, sorry it's a little bit mixed up because yesterday I did Henry I, and now today I'm doing Henry VIII. But it's a bit of a mix up, so hopefully... Um, yeah, you will enjoy. Okay, so, Henry VIII was born on the 28th of June, 1491. As the second son of, Edward, uh, of Henry VII, he was not expected to become king. All this changed in 1503 when Henry's elder brother Arthur Mysteriously died. R I P. That means Ah Henry was heir to the throne. Who the thought that? Okay, now on the twenty first or the twenty second of April, fifteen hundred and nine, Henry the seventh died. Reason his seventeen year old son, Henry. The coronation took place on the 24th of June and with his new bride, Catherine, they were married. During Henry's reign, great, and I mean great, acts were restored. Great acts, but I will be telling you a little bit, not, not a lot, but a little bit on how you how he did it. His first act between the periods of 1513 and 1529 was to also claim the French throne. Now, a hundred years er, earlier there had been a French king. There had been an English claim to a French throne. Now, Henry the fifth of England was the son in law of Charles the sixth of France France and he just basically handed over him as heir to a throne in the fifth. Which means that his successor, Henry the Sixth, and his successor, Edward the Fourth, even though theoretically in 1453, all his lands were lost. He, there had been a claim to a French form once before. Now, what I mean by a French form is a, an England's monarch sitting on the throne of France and England. No king has ever done this before. Henry VI had, but theoretically was only crowned in Paris. Paris. Okay, so again back to Henry VIII, he only managed to capture one little, little town. Okay, okay now, <coughs> something else that we didn't think about is the who would be governing in England. And I can tell you something that will be Henry's wife, Catherine of Aragon, a beautiful young princess. Now, in 1514, Catherine killed the king's brother in law, who was also who was called James of Scotland. Just to prove what a clever little girl she was, he, she, sent the blood stains to, to his, to his state. Now guys, I'm going to tell you a little bit more about his youth. 
So, yeah, guys, this is just a little information video, but we are going to be doing more. Do not worry. So, guys, this is Harrison. Expect more videos. And goodbye.